There was a computer here. Then there was a and everything went black. Dropping my computer off at Technology for Tomorrow. Let's find out what's wrong with her. Now that I don't have a computer, it's a good time to do something I've been putting off. Okay, we're gonna start. I know the first of the year rolls around and everyone starts doing the cleaning the closet out. Ah! Yeah, I usually avoid that like the plague, but uh, it's time to redo this studio. So I just realized I put this on backwards and now I don't remember which way is the loose way. Is this the loose way I'm going? Always, always suspicious when there's stuff left over. Like, was I supposed to use that for something? I'm finished cleaning for the moment, going to the beach to do a project with a friend. My friend Christy, she has this effervescent, enthusiastic spirit, and I love that. So of course, when she asked for help on this project she was working on, I said yes. I love when you get a chance to do these sort of spontaneous projects. <laughs> so much fun. I mean, look at this. It's definitely a lot like herding cats. Christy came up with this idea because she really wanted to bring a little joy to the community and she wanted to show off the community. And I think she's doing an awesome job. And this is the fun part. If you want to take a look at the finished project, I will put a link below. Check it out. Of all the things to have happened, you know, having the computer go down, yeah, that, that definitely makes it difficult uh, to edit videos when you don't have a computer. But I didn't expect this. I got COVID and since I take care of my mother, she also got COVID and it's been a very hard two weeks. It's very hard to watch someone you love get sick. And while I know that, you know, not obviously not everybody dies who gets COVID, um, but you don't know. It's, and it's such a, a weird virus. It just goes up and down. It fluctuates all over the place and you think you're getting better and then it slams you again. And I, I wouldn't wish this on anyone, but I think we're getting better now. We don't have fevers and uh, just fingers crossed, lots of prayers. Um, that we get better. Obviously, this puts a hold on putting out any creative endeavors, creative works. But I, I'm determined, I'm not going to let anything stop me. So I'm going to do it come hell or high water. One way or the other, I will make stories for everybody.